Reds are Team A, Team B are the Cardinals, and Team C are going to be the A's. Tony Torsia is our hitting instructor, also handles our catching. Jay Murphy is one of our infield coaches. The lines don't matter. Rod Delmonico, former coach at the University of Tennessee, now at Florida State. And Rod handles our infield and base running. Andre Rabowin, 35 years of professional baseball experience as a player and a pitching coach. He is involved in our pitching instruction. Travis Wilcox, a former assistant equipment manager with the Detroit Tigers. Jeff Brueggemann, six years as a professional pitcher. He's handling our pitching as well as being uh, my assistant in directing the camp. My name is Rick Dell. I'm the director of baseball operations for uh, Major League Baseball in Asia. Remember, work on your first move, your drop step. Today is uh, August the 14th, Go. and we are at the Wuxi Sports Center at the baseball stadium. Our second week and our second day of the MLB Youth Academy in China. It's going to be hot today. My take on China in baseball, when I walk into the stadium here every morning and get off the bus and come into the stadium, my take is that you know baseball is an on thing here, that it's developing, it's great, guys are into it. I know that Jim Lefevre and Bruce Hurst are doing an outstanding job with the national team. Yeah. And now we're working, uh, probably coming from the other direction, in a more grassroots type level, getting baseball into the school system, and then working here on the first National Youth Academy, where we're getting players from all over the country, bringing them to a central location, and what you've got to do is you've got to get them interested, keep them interested, let them have fun, and let the best come out on them. Let me have the Golden Tigers here for a minute. Golden Tigers. This group here is a special group, special research project. They're called the Golden Tigers. This is the future of Chinese baseball right here. Baby Ruth, Megan Mano, Hank Aaron, Johnny Bear, Bad Davidson, Carol Robinson, Ted Williams, Yoyo Berra, Willie Mays. We're developing baseball. We're working on quickness of feet and transfer of the ball from the glove to the hand. There you go. Way to go, Mr. Wong. Well, I see some raw talent, uh, tools-wise. They need to learn how to play from the heart a little more, and it's only because they haven't had enough game experience. We're going to throw ground balls, and we want to make the tag when we field it. They know how to execute the swing, and they, and they have an idea on fielding and throwing. But, you know, when it comes game time, you have to play from the heart a little bit. And then these, what you know mechanically comes to the forefront, and you can execute a little better. Why, why, why? Never been to China. I've been to Chinatown in uh, San Francisco and New York. I don't know if that counts, but uh, this is like a huge Chinatown that just never stops. Throw longer distances. They have to back it up. It's a real challenge working with 13 to 15 year olds, but it's also very rewarding. It's kind of going back to the basics. We're getting real good at it. If you're trying to keep the base, just learn to catch and throw and hit. If you can keep the most three things, all the rest will come. We've zoomed in on the right age group. If you can hit that 12, 13 year old group and teach them the fundamentals, by the time they begin 16, 17, 18, they're going to be a real good player. The whole thing we're trying to do right now is to get them to move their feet as outfielders go and to work on coming through the baseball because a lot of kids at every age go like to stay back and let the ball come to them instead of them going to get the ball. Now guys what we're going to do is fly ball. I don't see anything different than the kids that we see in the United States. The young kids wanting to learn about the game wanting to understand fundamentals, wanting to improve, make it fun, try to show them the essential things that they'll need to be good baseball players and build off of it each day. I think one of the things that you have to do is you have to do what you say you're going to do. You know, if you say you're going to come and you're going to run an academy or you say you're going to come and do something, that you have to do it. And that's where you develop trust. It's about getting out every day, waking up, and giving these kids a Cooperstown edition. Quite it, quite it.
There's a lot of people here that want to play the game. Ready to go, Thurman? It's our job to promote it. It's our job to develop coaches, and it's our job to develop players. All right, we're going to do a drill now called the monkey drill. Okay, we're going to have a pitcher here on the mound throwing this way. We're going to have another pitcher over here. We're going to have another pitcher over there. We're working on covering first. We're going to hit the ball to first baseman. He's going to pitch it to the pitcher uh, underhand covering first base. I'm going to hit a ground ball to the pitcher. He's going to turn around, crow hop, throw to second base. Hopefully get a double play out of it. I'm doing third base. Perfect. And one word is, is culture. We're not talking about Chinese culture. We're talking about you create a baseball culture. And, uh, and that's important, but you got to get exposure to create that. You know, when you're a kid on the playground in, in, in my era, and you're growing up, you're, you're playing with your neighborhood gang every day, and you're playing softball one day and baseball the next day, and you got a rubber ball one day, and the next day it's a tennis ball, next day it's a wiffle ball, and then you get back to a baseball. Once that starts to rip, you tape it up, now you got a heavy baseball. Change up is this one. It takes time. Things take time. And, and there's a starting point for everything. But that's the evolution of, of developing a baseball culture. You know, they've got a great badminton culture in this country. They've got a great ping pong culture. That didn't happen in 15 minutes. Cardinal pitchers, Hong Che, Tosho. Hong Che's Tosho, to that side to Okay. We're getting ready to play the big game. Reds and the A's. Itaro, Alomar, Winfield, Glavin. I see a lot of prospects. I see a lot of kids that, if they continue to develop, we might be reading about them, you know, with the national team, and then maybe in pro ball one day. We're starting in a stadium. We're not starting in a cow pass. You know, we're jumping off in an academy. <笑>能让我的老脑子非常灵活变得很聪明信心信心是最重要的努力练球觉得比较有挑战性打棒的时候打得很远心也很心非常非常振奋棒球很好的体现了一个团队合作的精神这个是很重要的就是说每个队员九